by the power of Neverland. I have a podcast! Hey Neverlanders, it's me, Jeremy the Spider Pan, with you to give you another Disney Infinity 3.0 review. This time I'm doing something a little bit different. Instead of reviewing a toy box, I wanted to review a new figure that just came out with the new Marvel Battlegrounds, which came with Captain America the First Avenger. Now, I have been quite fond of the Captain America Avenger. It's it, a figure. It's been great. You know, I love the setup where you can charge up the shield and have it ricochet off several enemies when you throw it. It's it's a really great figure. I've had a lot of fun with it. And when they first said they were going to release another Captain America figure, I was kind of wondering, well, why is that? Uh, do we really need another one? But uh, this is a very cool figure. I really do like the design. The pose of the figure is very cool. And of course, now as you're seeing in this video, I took it right in and started testing it out right here in the Urban Brawl, which is a great way to level up your characters. I am very impressed with the way this figure can easily dispatch some more powerful foes at very early levels. I'm taking on boss level or large characters and, you know, taking them out in large groups very simply. Uh, his moves are great even when you just get started. Now, I have leveled him up a bit since then, and he does have the ability to charge up the shield. Uh, I haven't seen if he has the ability to ricochet his shield off multiple opponents, but this seems a lot of the design of this character is specific for Marvel Battlegrounds. In fact, the cinemas in Marvel Battlegrounds do feature this particular version of Captain America in the main storyline, along with some other Marvel characters, some of them that were also released specifically for 3.0. Overall, I'd say this is a great character. Uh, I can't tell if he's more powerful than the normal Captain America or not, but uh, the, the moveset he has is very good. It has a very quick, simple, easy combo. Uh, has made for in Battlegrounds. I've been able to just kind of continually hit with his combo. And I will be reviewing my thoughts of Marvel Battlegrounds. Keep a lookout for that video as well because I did jump in there and try out a little bit of verses and uh, I will be showing you the entire round I had of trying out some of the verses because I have a feeling that's what most of us are going to be spending a lot of time on is playing with our friends, whether hopefully online. I haven't seen anything about being able to play this online, but we should be able to. Uh, I will be experimenting in that field with the PlayStation SharePlay. But overall, this figure, very good figure. I, I've really enjoyed uh, using his different uh, skill sets and everything. Uh, I think I'm going to have a lot of fun playing with this character. I just wish there was more I could do with him besides play around in the toy box. I'd like to take this version back to, say, 2.0 and play with him on the Avengers storyline or something like that. Uh, but overall, I'd like to see more with this character uh, because, yeah, I really think this is a solid one. It's definitely worth getting him uh, with, of course, Marvel Battlegrounds, which so far I'm having a lot of fun with. But I, like I said, I'll talk about that in another video. But until next time, remember to check out our website at NeverlandPodcast.com. Make sure you subscribe to us on iTunes or Stitcher or Blueberry to hear the weekly audio podcasts.